Yes. <laughs> Here comes the boss, a two-year-old Belgian Malinois who is now fighting drugs and crime at the Johnson County Sheriff's Department. Uh, he actually came from originally from Mexico. Uh, we went and acquired him through Little Rock Canine in uh, Little Rock, Arkansas. Uh, boss has been in training down there for about three months. Uh, I spent the last two and a half weeks down there uh, learning the commands and getting attached to the dog. As a dual-purpose dog, Boss can locate narcotics, track, and apprehend criminals. Sheriff Castle says in the short time he's been with the department, he's already made an impact on the community. This is actually his fourth day, and uh, we were called out yesterday morning, uh, actually. And during the traffic stop, Boss did alert to the vehicle, and we recovered uh, crystal meth from the vehicle after his alert. So, yes, he's, he's already been successful, and he loves his job. He loves his work. At Pikeville Medical Center, we believe that together we can make a difference in the fight against cancer. We are proud to have patients who have experienced successful outcomes over many years. As always, we believe in the power of faith. Pikeville Medical Center, where cancer can be defeated. In the past, Johnson County Sheriff's relied on other agencies' canines for fleeing subjects and location. However, with their own, they hope to make an even greater impact on the community. Drugs, like everywhere else, is a huge problem, uh, and, but that's nationwide. Uh, and we have seen it ourselves here in Johnson County. I grew up here, and this is the worst I've ever seen it. Um, so we are, we are determined to make a difference, to get these drugs off the street. And that's what uh, Sheriff Saylor uh, plans on doing with this canine. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.